The museum will not only document the dangers officers face, but will also honor the sacrifices of law enforcement families. At three o'clock in the morning on February 5th, 1997, a 23-year-old man was thrown out of a nightclub. Just as he got to the intersection of Georgia and Missouri Avenue, the light changed. A police cruiser pulled up to that light and because the light was red, it stopped. The young man walked around to the driver's side of that police cruiser and he fired four times, striking the officer in the head. That officer was our son. When asked why, the 23-year-old said, because one cop was as good as another. Without having any idea of what he was taking away from that officer's family. We have so little left when our officers are killed in the line of duty. We only have photographs. Survivors need to know that our loved ones will never be forgotten.